idea was to come up with something unique that no other prize ever attempted. What this has done for artists in the region is that it's allowed them the chance to be able to show the world what amazing centres of creative excellence there are across the region, all the way from North Africa through the Middle East to South Asia. From the history of Cairo to the centrepiece of the Al-Aqsa Mosque in Jerusalem, to the damnation of war in Lebanon. These are three very important themes that are current and that affect our lives in, uh, every day here in this part of the world. For us, the Advanced Capital Art Prize was a very important expression of ensuring that the young generation, the young upcoming aspiring artists, have got an ability not only to express themselves, but be recognized in the global stage. My work is about the history of the individual. When Cairo would appear on the news, it would appear on the news because of big news, and not really about what regular person has to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. And I see that all the small stories carry within them indications that take you to read the bigger stories, but maybe from my perspective, from a more honest perspective. which is normally known for its history of 5,000 years ago, it's wonderful to see an artist address the stories of today. What is for me interesting about this working experience in particular is the amount of people that I had to collaborate with on a very close situation. That to me it was the bringing together of all these people that made it the most challenging on one hand and at the same time something that I would not want to change on the other hand. I've always been fascinated by architecture and relation between uh, uh, architecture and humankind. People can see it like a big iconic celebration and at the second step discover that it's only a bolt, a small bolt. It was so different from anything Kader had done in the past. His works are normally very large scale, and this work is the size of my nail. I'm very happy that Kader Atia got the Abrach Prize because I really believe in him and think he will be a very, very important uh, artist in future. That I'm convinced, and I'm not the only one. He's used very contemporary signs and symbols and questioned how they come together to form a myth and also how myths are dismantled as well. A closed space where you get into it and then you forget what's happening outside. And this is what the feeling of the people, it's like we're outside everything and we're in hell or or heaven or wherever, but we're in a very specific place. When you propose a project, even with all of Arwan's descriptions of what he wanted to do, it's nothing like when it's put together. So for us, I mean, we were also discovering it. Mm. We also want artists from the region to have some sort of international exposure or a dialogue with someone international. And that's how the idea of having them work with an international curator came about. And what the international curator did was really push the artist's boundaries. Because I'm not used to this kind of like deadline. I used to say in the studio, 
and then uh, and I decide to exhibit and everything is ready and you only have to hang the stuff and then here it's like I was a little bit stressed during the construction and then Nahita was like don't worry you have two days two nights uh, no sleep <laughs> we're gonna nothing. do it, we gotta do no it. Problem. No problem. but that's it at the end yeah it was uh, great and then with help of a lot of all the people in the contractor around us yeah okay Amazing experience, yeah? Yeah, yes. A good, a good opportunity. When I applied to it, I remember telling someone that I am very happy that I am applying to something that is actually targeted towards me. And that does not usually happen. We're always applying to some European fund, some American thing, this residency here, there. It actually gave me a lot of pleasure and uh, comfort actually to feel that it's moving in the right direction in that sense. The Abraj Capital Art Prize is only in its second year but it's already established itself in the firmament of the art world. People look forward to this with more enthusiasm than any other art prize anywhere else. And it's because it's about a dream and it's about a journey.